Hello everyone. Did you know that in ancient times most civilizations did not have a word for the color blue? They really didn't. So what did they call the color of the sky then? Well, classical Arabic and Persian poetry usually call the sky green while Greeks called it grey or white. But now we all know of course that the sky is blue. But why? Why is the sky blue? For that matter, why does the sun look yellow in the sky? Let's try and figure it out together. Well, firstly, we notice that the sun only looks yellow during midday. It looks orange or red during sunrise or sunset. Another thing we can see is the photos of sun taken from the moon. Here we can see the sun looks white while the sky looks black. This gives us another clue. What is the biggest difference between the earth and the moon? Well, the earth has an atmosphere and the moon doesn't. So that must be the reason for this, the atmosphere. Ah, now that we know this, we can use the concept of Rayleigh scattering. See, when you see light of different colors, what you are perceiving is light of different wavelengths. So red light has a wavelength and blue light has a different wavelength. Importantly, blue light has a shorter wavelength than red light. And all of the colors of the rainbow, when mixed together, make white light. Now that we know this, we can understand Rayleigh scattering. See, when light hits the atmosphere, they interact with the molecules of air. Light of shorter wavelength, like blue, cannot dodge these particles well. And so it hits them and gets reflected in some other direction randomly. But light of longer wavelengths dodge particles easily. Thus they don't hit the particles and thus for the most part keep moving straight. Why is this true? Well look at this exaggerated small wavelength of light. Because it moves up and down in such a small length, it will probably hit the atom in front of it. But with this long wavelength, because it moves up and down in such a long length, that it will move around the atom. Believe it or not. This easy concept is the reason that the sky looks blue and why the sun looks yellow. Let's look at that. At noon, sunlight from the sun goes through the atmosphere. The blue and green colors get scattered, as we have talked about before, while the red, yellow and orange light pass through and reach your eye. Thus, you see the sun as yellow, while the sky looks blue because of the scattered blue light coming to your eye. This is better seen during sunsets when the light has to travel even more distance and so only the longest of the wavelengths reach your eye unscattered. Which is why you see the red sun of sunset. So why does the sun look yellow and the sky look blue? The answer is really scattering in the atmosphere. Or more simply, because of the atmosphere. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button. If you have any queries, comment down. And yes, don't forget to hit the bell icon and never miss another update from Let's Tube. Keep watching, keep learning and follow your curiosity. Thank you.